my beautiful queens and today I will be doing love triangle reading you know because third party situation videos so far they are most popular and this is the major energies I'm getting in February so let's make one more video um, to learn more about your situationship uh, will be three different piles uh, represented by three different cards pile number one choose this one if you like this luminous warrior this for pile number one for pile number two will be represented by the stuff so like this kind of giraffe <laughs> okay and pile number three will be represented by the child card okay very very interesting energies i'm getting um uh, from all three decks okay um, and let's start with those who choose this card pile number one first of all the number of cards 32 uh, 32 kind of hidden uh, um, third party is most likely hidden lover kind of hidden mistress or something like this um, and this relationship in in shade kind of shady type uh, but um, she wants to make it official she tend to uh, to get to number five because this three and two um, gives us five okay so uh, pile number one let's take a look on plans of your partners plans and feelings toward okay his plans and feelings towards you true love wow towards you so this is romance of lifetime he thinks about you Okay, but what are his plans and um, feelings towards third party? Okay, let's take a look. His plans and feelings toward. Okay, soulmate. Uh, this man kind of, you know, loves tiramisu and cheesecake at the same time. Yes, this is your soulmate. So with you he feels true love, with her he feels like she is so mad and that's why it's so difficult to choose. Uh, okay, let's take a look on plans of third party towards your man. Plans and feelings, her plans of feelings towards your man. Okay, let's take a look. Very interesting. Very okay give your relationship it a chance so she gonna fight and work on this partnership that's her plans she wants to give this relationship with your man a chance and he's kind of wants this and wants that true love and so made whom to choose and in, in such cases, I I'm usually um, recommend to choose someone really third, uh, because you know if you stuck in between uh, two women, uh, then either it's something wrong with you and you are narcissist. Um, because when it's really true, true love, as the card says. Uh, then no doubts, you know, but this so mad, you know, so mad, it, so mad, not necessarily meant to be true love, because with so mad, we kind of, you know, as with good friends, we, we feel a lot of similarities and we feel comfortable, just comfortable next to each other. And we can mistake in this comfort feeling for true love in cases, okay? So anyway, she wanna give a chance. Uh, what will happen if you let him go, kind of, and let go of the situation? What will happen if you let it go, let go of the situation, let him go? What will happen then, okay? Let's take a look. 
Keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. Definitely, if you let it go, you will meet someone new and very interesting and maybe very different from this man with whom you are now. And is it bad or good? It's only for you to decide because if you're dating with a narcissist who can't decide between, you know, true love and soulmate, then then maybe it's really better to, to meet someone new. Okay, and what will happen? Um, uh, kind of what will happen if you will fight for this relationship, you know, with all the means or something like this, okay? What will happen if you will fight for relationship? It is safe for you to love. Open your heart to be and receive the highest energy of all. Well, look, this card uh, not, not given a clear answer and I'm getting so many different messages for, for collective. First of all, I want to tell you uh, that if you will fight for this relationship, uh, you will learn um, trust, you will kind of learn how to trust again. You need to learn this if you want to be with person who was cheating on you, okay? And who is cheating uh, on you at the moment. Uh, and then you will learn more about um, self-love. And uh, see these angels uh, who protect in this woman, uh, and men kind of standing just behind. You know, if you will be fighting for this relationship, you might achieve the point where you want just to to leave him. You know, when you will feel kind of tiredness. Mm. Oh, the point when the man will back up you. This is different for different scripts because so many of you. Uh, or, or, or your man will learn how to back up you, to protect you, and this everything. But it will be a long fight. I'm getting kind of from uh, four months up to half a year you will need to fight for your relationship so see she's on a horse it's long ride it's long how oh, to fight it's not like you're winning him back over just three weeks no it's kind of half a year or more you will need to fight okay um will you end up with your partner after all will you end up with this man after all will you end up with him pay attention to red flags well if you want to love a narcissist then go ahead and maybe you will end up with him but most likely no because she's alone in this picture, there is someone kind of spirit or mother or another significant female figure who is kind of sending her flower message. But she's alone. She is alone on this card. Um, and it says kind of your desire to end up with him not appropriate. Uh, will she end up with your person? Will she end up with your person? Will the third party woman end up with your man? Let's take a look. Very soon. It's better card than yours, uh, but what does it mean? Uh, this, this seems together. Uh, he might uh, left you very quick for her, for relations with her. Kind of this is very soon, and then half year you will be trying to to get him back. But 
uh, very soon he may leave you for her and the same he may leave her next and very soon for someone new and this when when we dealing with um, true narcissist you know because true narcissist he is not reminiscing over love he pretends that he loves you he cares but in fact this is easy go man easy leave when a new skirt appears on horizon uh, he is bringing his cup to her with same bullshit uh, with same love bombing with same phrases same tricks to get her to get this woman so very soon this is easy go man and easy leave the same soon he will be leaving her so if she's celebrating a victory yeah they may end up together but this won't be everlasting relationship or long lasting relationship because any relationship with a narcissist has its own expiration date and this expiration date depends on the resource the main supply is given to him okay guys so please educate yourself and uh, last one card is your personal uh, love perspectives okay your personal love perspectives okay let's take a look your personal love perspectives i'm looking at energies kind of you know three months ahead not not much kind of not years if you want to take a look on years you know this is better to do with matrix private reading okay okay Romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. Okay, if you uh, if you won't fight, in a three months you will meet someone new and someone who will treat you differently and will treat you better, but who might not suit your expectations. Uh, for example, you love brunettes and you kind of a, and blonde man gonna ask you out something like this so please pile number one leave me a comment how does it resonate with you this reading what you will be taking for you okay and now we moving to those who choose this cute giraffe as a stuff card and this tough card kind of uh, consists of two energies, five and one, which together give six. Uh, we get in kind of official relationships, so those who choose this pile, you know, you, you can be in long-term relationship with your man whom you're asking about and then suddenly um, some woman pop up and taking him away from kind of long term because it's this tough also says about some collective you know strong collective kind of even family vibes which gives us fifth energy okay and together it's six six and minus it's love triangles always always okay so let's take a look uh, on his feelings and plans towards you okay his feelings and plans towards you pile number two his feelings and plans towards you his feelings and plans towards you and we have forgiven and learning as you release and heal the past you experience more love in your present moments okay i'm getting by kind of maybe um not all of you but some some percent of collective maybe you was the first who cheated on your man or, or not cheated just flirt with someone and it caused kind of huge jealous jealousy wave in him and he decided to take his revenge in flirting with other women or something like this because he had forgiven and learning his plans or some of you at some kind of divorce stage you know and 
uh, this con constant fights with whom children will stay and everything very sort of difficult divorce stage, you know. But for sure, those who choose second power, you have a lot of past uh, memories together, past situations, or maybe you took a decision uh, which kind of lead to um, uh, this uh, sulk from the side of your man. Maybe you was offered a job in other country or city, uh, or, or even not a job, but a trip. You know where you need to to live and stay some time abroad at some company department. Um, this kind of vibe I'm getting here because for given on learning his plans towards you okay let's take a look on his plans and feelings towards her because for him you know to be with you you know it need to be for forgiveness and learning of mistakes maybe you you was repeating same mistake over and over in relations with him you know and someone gets sick and tired of this and was huge explosion of feelings of this which was silent for, for time silenced okay and with her very soon clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now okay and at this stage he's not sure about her but very soon he need to take decision either to be with you either to be with her okay and your plans and feelings towards your man. Okay, let's take a look. Uh, about her, he will be taking decision very soon about her, okay? He will be taking very soon decision. He doesn't decide yet, okay? And we have your feelings and plans towards your man, your person whom you're asking about, okay? Your plans, okay, true love, this is the romance of lifetime, yeah. Uh, she sees him through true love being glasses, okay, at the moment, and she's sure that, and, and look, they, they're repeating these two cards very soon, and true love, uh, same, you know, poses of man and female, um, and that very soon also we have some angel, and kind of guided from above decision and uh, here is just clear picture they just together and that's it anyway uh, she have very romantic feelings towards him okay what will happen if you um, if you uh, fight for this relationship okay pal number two what will happen if you will fight for this relationship will fight for your man um, what will happen Unrequired love, please don't push, don't fight. There is not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. Please don't, don't fight for for him. This will only, you know, kind of be perceived as unrequired love, you know. Don't push, don't chase him, okay? And what will happen if you let uh, him go? What will happen if you let him go? Just you know, kind of. If you let him go, what's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? It is safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of love. Much, much better forecast. So it's better for you to let him go. Anyway, we need to know will you end up together with him? Will you end up together with this man, this person? Will you end up together? After all, you know. Pay attention to the red flags. Uh, last cards is just similar to pal number one. Um, it's no. And will she end up together with your man? Will she end up together with your man? Will she end up together? Because here you have kind of very big fight uh, equal to ten of swords uh, if we're talking about traditional tarot deck and it's not easy to forgive, uh, you know, and to gain trust again in relationship. Will she... Kind of stay with your man after all. 
past life relationship you have known each other before yeah they they will most likely they will stay together um after all yeah because they knew each other and it's either pain karmic depths uh, either reconciliation of souls uh anyways it's your personal your personal love perspectives for nearly three months your personal love perspectives for next three months from the date you're watching this video okay release your ex yeah the time has come to clear your energy oh my god so please work on it work on it work on releasing your ex i'm working now you know on writing special prayers a healing prayers you know which will help to release a past um so that was your reading pal number two please let me know how does it resonate okay and we move in to those who just pal number three most interesting the child <laughs> I felt like um, even kids involved into this love triangle or somehow this relationship um, you know help your inner kids to reconnect something like this as a child either you're dreaming about the child or with this man um, this is very interesting vibe either maybe those of you who chose pile number three may be pregnant at the moment I don't know uh, let me know in comments please and we will take a look on your energies and first of all let's ask cards about his plans and feelings towards you okay his plans and feelings towards you his plans and feelings towards you please Part number three love yourself first your self-respect makes you makes you more romantically attractive okay you will become again attractive in his uh, eyes if you will start uh, loving yourself and you know self-love is a huge problem um, of 21st century okay when we have everywhere in media all these high standards uh, for women and everything so self-love become a huge huge problem we often pretty often with lack of self-love of self-acceptance especially of our appearance and our personality and uh, more than word mostly about gaining love of other people we want to be likable you know all of us want to be likable uh, anyway next his plans and feelings towards third party towards her his plans and feelings towards her towards third party okay attraction you attract romantic love by enjoying this moment okay I, i'm getting feeling that he felt attracted to her because uh, she is the woman with a strong self-love sometimes strong self-love means being femme fatale and at some point being narcissistic okay just at some point when it's too much of you know self-love and self-hate at one plate we we are getting this narcissistic uh, personalities kind of you know femme fatale which shows self self-love on the surface mostly and he feel attracted to this and you lack of this self-love that's, that's why he fell and attracted to her okay and her plans and feelings towards a person you asking about okay her plans and feelings about person you asking about okay let's take a look give your relationship a chance yeah she wanna give them a chance and work on the partnership 
Okay, what will happen if you will fight for this relationship? I mean, actively. Kind of messaging him, you know, talking to him, trying to, you know, to get your relationship better, to improve your relationship. Okay, what will happen if you will fight for your relations? Getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Okay, uh, it's kind of um, stage of getting to know each other again at the point if you change your behavior pattern and st uh, start love yourself, start loving yourself. And then kind of you know it will be a vibe that uh, he will get a feeling that he uh, meet a different person uh, whom he need to explore again to to because he used to uh, some particular uh, behavior pattern from your side maybe when you was begging and everything everything. Um, and this time I, I'm getting a message that you should behave with more dignity, okay? Uh, so this will make him kind of wanting, wanting to know you again, to, to get to know you again. Okay, what will happen if you let him go? What will happen if you let him go? And you know, to fight for relationship, you, you kind of, you kind of can fight um, secretly you know, with different female tricks we have in our <laughs> arsenal, let's say, a lot. Okay, if you let him go, calling in your soulmate, your prayers, affirmations and visualization help bring you together. So you will start, if you let go, then, then start to work on calling another person start calling your soulmate okay um, okay will the third party stay with your person after all will the third party stay with your person after all playfulness to recapture your mouth, allow your inner useful spirit of fun to shine. Mm, you know, they, they kind of together, but for how long this playfulness will go? It's nothing serious. Yeah, they, they, they might be together, but nothing serious. Okay, will you stay with your person after all? The general outcome, will you stay? With your person after all, will you still let's see who have stronger card you or her? Okay, heart to heart conversation. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other. No. Here I, I'm getting no. Because look, she's whispering uh, to his ear and he's looking away and here he's looking at her all his focus on her because she's playful and la 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 she loves herself and they are uh, kind of um, outcome for you that you might get closure when you kind of chase and push this man to, to give you closure uh, on situations you know but he's not interested. You you won't stay with him after all. She will stay, but for how long this playfulness will be enough? We don't know. Okay, your personal love perspectives for nearest three months. Okay. Your personal love perspectives for nearest three months. Nearest three months after this situation, third party situation will be over, you know, when you know that it's clear and your personal love perspectives. Okay, what do we have here? You deserve love, you're lovable. Finally, you will learn how to love yourself first and you become lovable and you will be calling, you know, you will be calling in your true soulmate because this man it's kind of not not your true soulmate. 
And here is the bottom of the deck. I grab it so it will end for you. Next love relations for sure will uh, end for you with a wedding and romantic feelings because this card just popped down, popped up, you know, as well. So yeah, work on calling your true soulmate because with man uh, with whom you now involved. Uh, he was given to you so for you to learn how to love and respect yourself okay and to understand that uh, you deserve love and what quality of love you know you deserve okay so that's your message pile number three please leave me a comment how do you like your reading and see you in my next videos Bye!